Well, this is security footage of someone stealing a tiny home from a storage facility in North Spokane. The woman who owns this home says her safe space has now been taken away. Marissa Rio shares her story. Right behind me here is where surveillance footage caught someone stealing a tiny house Monday morning. I spoke to the woman who owns that house and she's devastated. She says it was more than just her home and she hopes it can find its way back to her. And when it's your home, it's more than a thing. It's a relationship. Karin Potter's college dream turned into a nightmare. My feelings since learning about this uh, on Monday have really been more feelings of grief around what it's like to lose a loved one. Um, Karen and her friends built the home themselves. I did a lot of the designing, but the, the house was a labor of love. She lived in the tiny home from 2017 to 2021 before having to put it into storage due to struggles during the pandemic. You know, this house was a safe place for me for a long time and a place that I've dreamt of getting back into um, as soon as I can. Karen says her home was stored behind a locked fence and had a hitch lock on it. She yearns to have her dream back and hopes the community can help. It's really about spreading the word and, um, you know, people can go on social media and help repost things and spread the word. The theft happened at a storage facility on East Francis between North Napa and North Crestline. An official there says they are currently working with the police but declined to make any further comment. I'm so grateful to the Spokane Police Department. Their response has felt really immediate. I really have a sense that they are working very hard to help me recover this house. If you have any information regarding this stolen home, you're encouraged to call Crime Check at 509-456-2233. In Spokane, Marissa Rio, 4 News Now.